I was very pleased to see the um, Feather River Canyon background um, on the game because uh, I'd seen it on someone's desktop at work and thought, ooh, that's a bit special. I like that. Can you set up the controller to automatically press buttons? How do you mean, Oblop? What is it you want to make it do? Because you can kind, you can make it do all sorts of things, actually. It can't magically predict what you want to do, though. <laughs> Uh, hello, driver. This is a stopping passenger service from Newton Abbot, Heathfield and back. Open the doors. The scheduled departure time is 4.03. Let's get the doors open. So this is an interesting one because there's all sorts of things that you you can't do normally. Like I can use the wipers and uh, I can open the window. Open the door as well. Just again, stuff you just can't do with a controller. So you're getting a much more rich experience with this controller if, if a controller is what you're looking for. Right, it's time to go. So now I can ask the uh, release the brakes. Brakes are coming off. Setting forward. And away we go. So you need, with this one, you need to press the E key to unlock the reverser. Because if I just use the up and down key, nothing works. So I've set it up. So if I press the grip and the pad together, then the the lock comes down. a change I've only just made to the uh, the setup actually. Come around the corner here. Now this 25 is a bit, it's actually a little bit deceptive, it does not really a 25. It caught me out earlier on when I was trying this out. Passenger fail? Why is there a passenger fail? Oh, whoops. <laughs> I left when the doors were still open, didn't I? Oh dear. Good fun to drive. Stex Red, this is a coach. It's called an auto coach. And then uh, I'm driving from the coach and I'm using um, the uh, the bell sequences to communicate with the fireman who is in um, the steam loco here, pushing the train. Which is why these bells keep going off. I've got control over the regulator. Right, now we can speed up. is Ten Grace. Ten Grace. Pronunciation police will be on at me in a minute. Building up speed, I'll get the uh, fireman to change it.
What's that? So again, you can operate anything by just moving your hand over it, and, and uh, so there's the handbrake. I can swing the handbrake off if I want to. I didn't really want to, if I'm honest. Cheers, GWR. You want us no problem at all. Right, there's ten grace up there. Does the fireman control the reverser? Yeah, I use bells to tell the, from the fireman what to do. So um, I've got when I press a single bell while I'm accelerating, the fireman will change the reverser up or down depending on the speed that we're going. So, for example, if I because we're under 30, if I do a single bell, it'll pop it back up to about 40 something percent. There you go. So the reverser just got pushed back up to 40 something percent. So I'll be in a better position to accelerate. In a minute, I shall tell him to put it into ready to stop, in which case he will uh, set the brakes up ready for me to apply them and um, put the reverser back into full forward. Yeah, they are obsessed about me failing. Gives me a complex, to be honest. <laughs> Going up a hill here. Right, let's tell him that we're going to stop. Too hard on the brakes. Oops, this is the problem, there's a delay in everything, so... Brakes are coming off now, so I can now push into the platform properly. Pata, which means I'm now in a position to open the doors. Right, so that's that's that. We're doing all right. A bit early still, given that we left the platform a teeny bit early. Usually three bells after two bells. Yeah, that way you're <laughs> you air going in one and out the other. Oh dear. Yeah, the stream overlay is getting a bit complicated. At some point, we ought to get back to just focusing on the game. <laughs> It's all about the fame. It certainly is. It's all about the fame. At some point the fame will come. When will the fame come? See so thanks for the follow, much appreciated. Fame, that reminds me. Brighton Model World. Don't forget Brighton Model World folks. I'll be there on Friday and Saturday. Adam Lucas will be there Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And Steve I believe is gonna try and make an uh an appearance on Sunday. 
Perhaps you can confirm that, Steve. As always, no appearances. Presences, wherever, are guaranteed. We'll do our best. There you go, Steve just posted all the details about Brighton Model World. If you can make it down to Brighton Model World, it'd be good to uh, catch up with you. Make yourself known, say hello. Map is really useful, and how could we cope without seeing your expression when things go wrong? Well, yeah, I know. <laughs> it's only one problem, it's in Brighton. Yep, Sunday for Steve, Moggy. Is it time for going yet? Yeah, it's time for going. Right, in that case, uh, let's brakes off. Be known by, am I into model trains as well? Certainly am. Kevrev, I will be there. Yes, I'm going to be there all day Friday and all day Saturday. So yeah, if once we get this speed up to about sort of 12 miles an hour, we can hit the, we can do another start bell, a single being bell, and um, the fireman will then change the um, reverser for me. Cut off. There you go. She's now done. Next station is Heathfield Down. So this journey is basically Newton Abbott to Heathfield and back to Newton Abbott. It's not a long journey. But it means we get to drive both ends of the train, which is, so it's quite interesting, a bit different. So be train spotting. I, I can't remember the dates for... Um, for it, something like the 19th, something along that, with that sort of weekend-ish, maybe? I don't know, don't take my word for it. Amarillo would have to go through London. What's wrong with London? <laughs> Why are you hearing the sound of a steam engine? Because steam engine... <laughs> We're being pushed by a steam engine. That's how this works. I'm driving from a coach. Cheers, train lover. Bollers, I'm sorry here you're having problems with uh, buffering, that's no good. Heading into if Heathfield Down platform. I'm going to put it back. Tell him to go into stop again. That'll shut off the uh, all that wee waste leakage. Mm -hmm. 
So we stop off a Heathfield down platform, run round to the uh, the shunt at the other end, and then come back in on the other platform. The idea with this one, because you, basically you're annoying the fireman every time you say, release the brakes, apply them, release the brakes, apply them, and it all gets speed. So the idea is to try and, it sort of teaches you to be a little bit more um, careful with your brakes. And try and do it without having to release them all the time. Hopeless Hyena, so does, so does that mean that you're going to come to Brighton Model World then, my friend? Right, let's open the doors. Right, drive to Heathfield Bay shunt. So, uh, breaks off. As soon as he gets that, it'll release. You can see in the brass um, dial over there. Oh, wrong number. Try that. Well, I shall be there on Sat uh, Friday, Saturday. Adam will be there Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And um, Steve will hopefully be there on um, Sunday. Tell him we're going, otherwise we're not going to get any kind of power here. That's better. And we've got to push it to basically down past the, uh, the junction and then come back. Ah, uh, Ribku, all I'm hearing is, is excuses. <laughs> right, pull up to this signal. I love driving the auto coach, it's great fun, it really is. Right, change the cab and come to a stop at Heathfield up platform. So, this is where I need to switch. I haven't set keys up for doing this, so we'll switch to the other end. Come back here, and uh, now I'm in control of the reverser. Now I do need to make sure cylinder clocks are open, so let's. Yep, they're open. Good. good. Brakes off. Power on. platform, so we've just switched across to the other line. No wipers on this set, which is a bit of a downer.
Yeah, I'm rolling. You can move point lever anywhere you like. Just select the point lever as if it was an object in its own right. Right. Cylinder, something you don't have access to on the Xbox controller. Going downhill now on our way to Newton Abbott. Why do you suggest using the old chat box, Minecart? Everyone seems to like the new one. Yeah, I hope you're saying that the new coaches are good. I'm going to see if I can um, take a look at them tomorrow. Coal going in. We are keep class, we've not you have almost missed it mate. Yeah, oh yeah, I was in work today. I was in the work quite sparkly early. I had a meeting at 10 o'clock and with taking time off I wasn't even remotely prepared for it, so I was in, in the office, sat down at my desk for 7 o'clock. That's how you get back to work after you've been sick. Right, now, around here is the water, and then over here That's it, water's going in now That was about to get uh, tricky Oh no, we weren't in a bad situation Right away driver, cylinders are open, place of brakes.
Oh, I'm being drowned out, am I? I should speak up a little bit. Turn off the water, that's what's going to make all the noise. going off again. <laughs> yeah Kevin, it just needs a bit of fine tuning to customise the controller the way you want to use it and you can make it do... you can drive anything in the game. Because you can turn on the this and you can access everything. Your uh, you turn on the mouse so that you're you know you're in a good position to drive. Yeah. One of my favourite things to be honest, other than gyro is this thing here. This pop up menu and the fact that you can add extra functionality. You can have another one on the right mouse but on the right um, thing if you want to as well. Um, very, very good. Hey Armadar, I am driving the GWR14XX. I was driving the auto coach, but we changed ends. Can you add modifiers so better control to control and shift L? Yeah, because that's what the headlight does. Um, so the um, headlight plus is H and the like minus is shift H. <coughs> you absolutely can do that. can't hear me. I'll turn the game down a bit. How was that? Is that better? Can I script the Steam Controller so it makes T? No. Epic fail. <coughs> what is it? It is a 48. There you go. Twenty five limit coming up. I need to write a plug in for OBS which will automatically balance the volume so that it quietens the game down if it gets loud all of a sudden. <coughs> That'd be useful. Get Wi-Fi enabled coffee and tea machines. There you go. That would absolutely work, wouldn't it? I would say it's worse. We can still hear Matt. Ooh, harsh. Armadart, no manual firing. Don't do auto firing. We're fine. We're almost finished anyway. Viewing figures a bit down. Um, yeah, I think there's there was another game, something about um, driving lorries in America. <laughs> Ever since a um, a fireman um, back in MSTS days, I met up with um, a fireman who used to fire the 9Fs, and he walked me through how you fire steam engines in MSTS. Oh, hello. I can I can hear myself think, um, and it was. Um, it was, um, yeah, I've just never gone back. It's just, it's so much more fun once you understand how to do it properly. 
that not doing it properly just sort of seems like, well, why would I bother? Oh, a nice couple of new uh, Chris Rogers scenarios. Sure, pub. So we total the train on the buffers. Safeties are going off again. Obviously, put too much fire in there. Well, what do you know? We didn't tote all the train on the buffers. X and click that. Let's go have a look outside. Tell you what, the frame rate's a bit real, isn't it? I tell you what, the the truck that instantly sells a game like Euro uh, Truck Sim, um, American Truck Sim to me, um, is the um, Kenworth Cab over Aerodyne. That's always my favourite. How did I do that? I'm using the Steam controller, so you can, uh, even with the Xbox controller, you've got much finer handling of the uh, of where the camera goes and creating facial expressions that everyone laughs at on the chat. Which takes a bit of practice to get the hang of it. I'll get there eventually. There you go. I didn't finish. I didn't finish that. I did earlier. I, I I scored actually. I did quite a good job on this when I practiced on it. Yeah, it's the 14XX and Auto Coach, Chris. It's a beautiful loco pack. It really is. Okay. One more scenario. Let me uh, switch back to the correct panel.